Yeah, the signs are very good. Yeah, he's certainly as well as we've had him in a long, long time. And when you have that long break, all those other little niggles and aches and pains get a chance to, to catch their breath and, and fix themselves. And uh, yeah, he's as sound and as fresh and happy as, as he has been for a couple of years. 1,040 days since Val and Declare's 2019 Melbourne Cup win. Gates are back and they're racing. Val and Declare is late down the outside, but high. We were hoping he'd turn up for us the other day here at Flemington in the 2500 metre race, and he ran a particularly good race with 61 kilos. Mahican Heights just second from Val and Declare and Blue Cup. What about the old boy? Val and Declare runs a terrific race in third. Bart Cummings Day was always going to be the race that defined the spring. If he can turn up and, and run really well in the Bart Cummings, then we're probably entitled to think we can get him into the Melbourne Cup and, and have him in the sort of shape he needs to be to run a really big race in it. He needs to run in the top three, I think. He needs to do that just to qualify for the Melbourne Cup. You know, to be realistic about coming back here in a month's time and um, yeah you need to be very competitive there on Saturday. Obviously winning the Melbourne Cup is a great thing but he, he's just a lovely animal we, we love being around him and it was just a fantastic day we had a great group of owners in the horse and you know all of my own family and friends were there and um, you know as much as you sort of know how big the Melbourne Cup is you, you really get a total grasp of it when you actually win it and um, that was a, a, as everything I'd hoped it would be and more.